Hi, this is Derek the Nitwit Strong, and happy hump day to everyone who has a traditional work week. Um, today we went to Playa del Carmen, which was across about a 30 to 40 minute ferry ride, and it was pretty windy today. Um, the, on the way over there, we were rode in the first 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 class. I was gonna say first place, first class ca class cabin, which was inside had cushioned seats and was air conditioned. Um, my prefer to ride on the very top of the ferry and even if it's windy and hot and sticky and whatnot and I made my sister climb two flights of stairs of, of narrow stairs to ride on the very top on the way back that was our compromise she got first class on the way there which she almost never sits in first class because it's usually she's complains about the air conditioning anyway we went to Playa del Carmen the, we went to look for the well, the first thing we did was go to Krispy Kreme. Because, of course, they have a Krispy Kreme. And the donuts are just as good. Then we went to Walmart, which didn't have um, any yarn. <coughs> Excuse me. And so then I went to look for the yarn wholesaler, which the building isn't even there anymore. So no clue where it went, no clue how long it's been gone. Google Maps needs to get that fixed. They had my hopes up for nothing. We did go to, there was another Paracena, and the one here on the island actually had a better supply of yarn than the one um, on the mainland, and oddly enough, we have better internet signal, or um, cell phone signal on the island than we do on the mainland. So, I did make, do a video um, inside the, inside of Paracena, and I'll attach that at the end of this. And I am hot and sticky. Can't tell if I'm just hot and sticky and that's why I'm red or if there's a little bit of color. Um, I'm sure my neck probably is getting nice and pink. And um, if anyone wants to, if anyone wants to trade hours, trade hours, anyone wants to trade hours? I'll spend 60 minutes, you spend 60 minutes? No. If anyone wants to trade weather for about 12 hours, let me know. I forgot what it feels like to be in winter, and I know that I will find out soon enough on Saturday, but whew, I'm hot and sticky. So, anyway, I did get a little bit of um, stuff that the Arnie supplies today. So, let me pause this real quick, and I will show you everything I got. Okay, first off, inside of Walmart, there was at least the equivalent of a dollar store. I mean, every, it was called 18... 90, 1850 something. So, I got to these so I can carry around with me and wipe my face down whenever I get super hot. And then anytime you're walking on the strip, you walk past, I can't remember the name of this, well, I mean, this is for Lavalier, but there is, I want to, it's not Euro Gold, it's something, but they give out samples to everybody walking by on the strip. And this stuff, if you were to actually buy this lotion, is insanely expensive and I don't have enough wrinkles or vanity to be willing to pay a couple hundred bucks for a bottle of face moisturizer when my face is oily enough without it. I bought more no metal ponytail holders because I have been doing these out of all the ones I've made. And this is more of a fuchsia pink, not red. Out of all the ones I've made, this is so far is the only one that hasn't been claimed and I'm pretty sure my sister claimed will, will, claim it as soon as I get the end threaded in. So we've got that. And then here's the yarn from Paracena. I forgot the name already. My little... And this stuff does seem a little bit softer than the other Paracena yarn, but we've got a navy blue and a light blue and a royal blue, and that's to make ponytail holders for Yasmin, the dentist here on the island. And then we got the neon orange that I said should never be paired with a pink unless you want to traumatize a child, which you never know. And the little green that, the green's not quite neon-y enough to go with the orange for like, you know, psychedelic headache inducement, but you know, it's close. And then these, I did a quick Google search and it all came up in Spanish, so I may wait till I'm back home. And Google it again. But Paracena Chris. So we have black, 
purple, a very variegated purple, a variegated blue, and a yellow. And then we got this stuff, the nylon, because I'm going to make cat toys and whatnot out of it. And then, because just as much as you have to collect yarn to do projects, you have to have project bags. And these were $2 each. So we have this one and a cat. Hello, little miss. Excuse you. Hey, you little crackhead. She plays fetch. She'll bring it back eventually. That's one I'd want. We got this one. And this one. And this one. That one. That one. See? She's back with the ball. Okay. That went well. That one. That one. You gonna get stuck in there? Hello. Say hello. Oh. This one. I think this one is so cute. This one. What does that remind me of James Charles besides the fact that it looks like a guy wearing makeup and I know it's not a guy but I'm so... Seriously, it's the Mexican James Charles. So that is my acquisitions for today. Oh, and the, you saw the one, well, I guess technically. Okay, technically it's, yeah, my bed's still a mess. Okay, and the shoes are on the bed because they've never been worn, so they're still clean. Technically, it's a whip because I haven't weaved those in. But we have this, I think it says don't blink. Um... I think that's what it says. Yeah, that's a don't blink. And so I'm roughly halfway through-ish. But I'm not in a hurry now since I've got the other blues to work on for the ponytail holders. So anyway, that's where I am for today. And I'll check with you guys later. So the <coughs> the first place I went to, the yarn hut cellar, it's no longer there. Like the whole building's gone. So we're at Parasina, and this is they have the the pedo yarn. Um, this is actually softer than the other stuff, and it's a little over a dollar. So I'm picking up a couple different fun colors. Okay, this is not coming out. You, it's not showing how bright this is. But put these three together. That's purple. And you've got Mardi Gras. Oh. And. Just a second. Okay. So yeah. So like I said, in the last time we were at Paris, you know, the kitty ones are all um, acrylic. So these, oh, you know, the kitty soft ones are all acrylic. Um. So I'm just gonna get a couple of those, mainly to make ponytail holders out of. They do have. this um, Parisian crease and it doesn't say what it is I may have to Google it and look it up I'm going to get a couple of these these are this is tiny but be good for um, Amagurumi so that's what 
we've got here. They also have this nylon, 100% nylon. Amount. It is tiny, but <laughs> not as cramped as that one place, but pretty cramped. I got some of this. I figure it'd be fun to play with. I've got this is all tiny stuff. But these are some. This is like a crystal from Bag of Day. Would like that one. She always likes the browns. Oh, and there's a pastel um, pastel rainbow one. But I like the bright colors better. So. If you get off on the left side of the boat, you're swimming to the... To I was asked to swim to the boat. What was that earlier? Was that the stairs or the stairs? How much about the boat? We came from behind. Okay. That was my boat. We're going to swim. 